All right, so <clears throat> we're looking to the into this app, neighbors. So what I am, I'm on my um, old iPhone, my iPhone six plus, I think this is. So we're gonna go into the neighbors app. We're look for it. So this is the app right here. Going to install. That was pretty quick. We're just gonna wait for it to um download. Alright, so now we're gonna open it. Okay, so neighbors would like to send you notifications, may include alerts, sounds, and icon badges. These can be configured in settings. All right, let's go ahead and do this. All right, so I was going to ask for my home address. So let me put in all that information and I'll come back. All right, so I put in all my information. And um, we're just going to go through the app a little bit. <clears throat> so basically what it is, is you put in your home address and it gives a perimeter um, around, you know, the, your neighborhood or, um, surrounding, whatever you're surrounding. So, I guess other people, um, they have, like, this thing called a ring unit. Okay, so this is the ring units that they have. They have it at Best Buy. They sell it at Dell, I believe. Let's just, shopping... Let's go up to $70. Wi-Fi HD, camera intercom, $12.99. Ring motion sensor. What's this? Video doorbell. So it's people like with this device. Um, but it is the company Ring. You know, it's the one where it shows you video. Ring solar charger for video doorbell. Wireless smart Wi-Fi doorbell. So it's one of these things. Anyway, here's another one here. One here, ring. Buy it. smart Alexa, yada, yada, yada. So it's all different yeah okay so yeah that's the unit they even have it in black you can watch it from your cell phone so I think it, it comes with a motion sensor and all that stuff so you can see people um, when they're you know in front of your house all right so back to the neighbor app so Let's see, let's take this one. Let's take this, and I just got a notification from them. So, a known visitor, 2.0 miles away, suspicious person in white car, he never rang doorbell, saw a camera and left. Has anyone actually spoken to these people or know what they want? I'm guessing one is the, let's go in here. Okay, you know what they want, update. update leaving cards okay so you can even leave comments on there I believe they are dropping off business cards check the front door and it even has other neighbors that respond maybe not post in the comments that you're away since everyone that sees this knows you're not home Oh, wow. Okay, maybe you should worry about your own sugar honey iced tea. I got mine handled. <laughs> I was trying to be a good neighbor. <laughs> oh, gosh. He probably left info hanging on your door. Doesn't look like a kid selling cookies, that's for sure. Although, just to let everyone know, I'll be knocking on their doors because my kids selling cookies laugh out loud. 
cooking elementary is selling cookies so if kids are knocking on doors that's why but if adults are knocking on doors and being dropped off by weird cars definitely makes me uncomfortable although i did get a sketchy note from someone who worked for the window company yesterday run for the hills they're gonna kill you <laughs> so i mean it's a whole bunch of different stuff on this app and i mean if if you oh yeah and it comes with the volume let's see if i can get it to work I don't know if you guys can hear it, but then they have some on here, a suspicious person. Oh, let me turn this off because I don't want to. Okay, cool. Suspicious person, doorbell, saw a camera. Well, what the hell was that about? Okay. Watch out for this man. Others have reported this drunk man is trying to sell books. Watch out for him. I've seen a lot of these door um, booksellers on here. But there was, I'm not going to lie, there was one that scared the bejesus out of me. I'm trying to look for it. It was like a few girls and they were up, they came up to someone's house. Let me see if I can... Oh, yeah, here's another good one. The bike thieves. Apparently, um, there's this truck going around. And what happens is, just by watching this neighbor app, a person, they get dropped off by that truck right there that's turning with the bike. And they ride the bike off. And I guess once they get to a safe distance, they'll put the bike in the back of the truck. And then they'll take off. Um, no one has been able to get the license plate yet, but I mean, I ultimately think they will be found. But let me find the one where, um, that, that scared me a little bit. You know what, what the heck, we'll come across it eventually. But, um, let's just look at a few. I mean, if you're nosy, this is definitely the app for you. Because <laughs> I gotta say, when I'm bored, this is what I watch. I don't watch YouTube. I watch this app. Look, I, I didn't know they still played, uh, what's it called? Ding Dong Ditch or something like that. I, I, I Evidently, I guess they still do. Coyote in it. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, let me press play. Maybe that'll help. See, it's right there. That looks like regular cat to me. That doesn't look like a bot. Well, I don't know. That that might actually be a bobcat. It's kind of hard to tell. Oh, I don't. It, it may. Well, I don't know. It could be a fluffy cat.
Okay, so basically I just looked up and seen we've been on this for about 10 minutes. So <laughs> this thing is, I mean, highly addictive. I mean, if you're bored, you'll probably, you know, watch it for hours. But, um, so if you want, go ahead, download the app. I mean, it, it's good to have, especially if you want to watch what's going on in your neighborhood. Um, alrighty guys, I just wanted to bring that to you. Um, oh, he's still on a plant. Look, there he is. He's walking. You can see him a little bit. Well, it looks like a few people. Anyway, so tell me, guys. <laughs> if you download it, let me know. And I'll see you later. Alrighty. Bye-bye.